What is up guys? I'm back with another video. And if I'm talking pretty quietly, it's because my fiance is sleeping in the other room and it's about midnight, so, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, so, a viewer uh, comment, or well, a few view viewers I should say, commented that they were having an issue with the wish list tutorial that I did for Twitch. And I did do that tutorial about five to four years ago. So it's a little outdated and since then Streamlabs has changed a lot. Went under new ownership, a lot of new software developments, updates, etc., etc. And for that video, nothing in that video will work now. Uh, just because they unfortunately took the, um, the widget for Streamlabs, uh, they took that out for the wishlist. So it's no longer uh, under the wishlist program. And so there's two different routes that I tried. One I succeeded, one I almost succeeded and then failed. Uh, so the first attempt that I did was to go through the uh, Twitch extensions through the panels. Um, and they do have two, two extensions. However, the one extension for some reason won't accept any links that I post for the wishlist, even though that's public. Uh, there's nothing wrong with permissions. For some reason, it will not accept any wishlist uh, link that I post into that um, extension. So then I went to the second extension, uh, which was Thorn. And Thorn worked to a certain extent. Um, so Thorn basically made, you, made me make a profile uh, or an account per se. And from there, I was uh, told that it was having to wait to get approved, my account to get approved, to be able to use the wishlist widget. And that was about four or five days ago. Um, and they have yet to approve me. I don't know if the wishlist is just, they just stopped doing it. They, they don't work with the extension no more or what, but both extensions basically failed on me. So it got me thinking, what can I do to technically still use the panels, but just a more generic route per se. So. I thought of an idea, I'm gonna hope it works, but in order to test that out, we're gonna actually have to hop over to the PC to see if that's gonna work. Um, also, thanks for the newest subscriber that also made this video possible. Well, not possible, but made this video happen, which I have her comment right here somewhere on the video. Uh, thanks for subscribing, thanks for your support, obviously, and hopefully this video helps you, and hopefully uh, they'll develop a more uh, accessible route per se to set this up but in the meantime hopefully this holds you over if you have any questions please don't hesitate drop a comment and I'll do my best to help you but with that said let's hop over to the PC okay so now that we're on the PC let me get this out of the way uh, so the first thing we're gonna try is obviously you're gonna want to sign into your account and then go to your channel if it wants to load Indebatable. Okay. Oh. Channel. And then we're going to go to about. And then edit panels. So this was the throne list that I was talking about. Um, I don't play my stream. Silly goose. Um, yeah. So this was the. Uh, wishlist uh, widget I was talking about the second one so we're gonna do edit panels and we're gonna remove that and then we're gonna hit this plus symbol add a text or image panel and then I'm gonna do add image so I will have this as a downloadable if you want to use this picture or you can use whatever picture you want if you want to make a custom one uh, but for right now uh, where did I put it? Oh, we put it under test. Upload. Bam. Done. So we got the image uploaded. Panel title. Well, I'm going to leave the plan panel title uh, un unnamed. And I, I just want to use the picture. So it should just fill that void with the picture. And you'll see why in a minute. So now we're going to go to Amazon. And we're going to go to, oh, I guess I got to sign in first. Uh, actually, I could just do this. Which one did I do? 
see more. Thought I had a Twitch one already made. I have like too many made. You see build. Oh, there it is. Blonde. We're going to do send to others, view only, copy. And then exit out of that. Come over here. Command V it or copy paste it. Submit. And I guess we can do click here to buy gear for the stream. Again, this is just for an example. I do stream, but I don't stream it like crazy, crazy. Okay, and then we can turn this off. And as you can see, it added it. And then just for an example, um, if I click on it, it will take me directly to the uh, wish list page. And then from there, they're able to purchase it. Um, yeah, that's actually the only way as of right now that I'm able to set up a wish list for Amazon that I've had that I had discovered, um, unfortunately. So, yeah, that's pretty wild. All right. So, as you can see, guys, uh, I mean, it's not the perfect remedy per se by no means, but it's the only one that I could figure out. Um, I was also reading on the forum that usually if you, um, or speculation on the forums were saying that the only way to get the access to the uh, wishlist application set up for the panels was to be an affiliate streamer. I don't know if that's true or not because I personally don't know any affiliates that were that could act. Um, but if you guys know, just leave me down in the comments. But yeah, I hope this video helped. Like I said, if you have any questions, please drop them down in the comments. And I hope this video helped. And I'm sorry that there was not a perfect go-to remedy. I was hoping for better than this. But unfortunately, the outcomes of the changes that they made, uh, obviously, have overcome some difficulties. But with that said, I hope you guys liked the video. If so, please leave a like. This helps me, or this lets me know that you like this type of content. Uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already, and uh, see you guys in the next video. Peace.